historic trip to space is just hours away now. Four people set to lift off in SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsule. It'll be the first all-civilian journey to the Earth's orbit. ABC News transportation correspondent Gio Benitez has all of the mission details. Hi, Gio. Diane and Terry, hello there. From launch pad 39A, the same launch pad used for the Apollo missions to the moon. Now you've got that Falcon 9 rocket right there, the Crew Dragon capsule right above it, ready to make history yet again. Now SpaceX is launching four civilians into orbit for three days, farther than any other private citizen has gone before, 360 miles away from Earth. That is farther than Richard Branson and Jeff Bezos went. It's even farther than the International Space Station. Now, that is a clear risk because this is the first time the Crew Dragon will go that far into space. Now, keep in mind, there is no professional astronaut on board. They also cannot go to the space station if there's an issue. And even if they could, they can't dock there because the docking mechanism was replaced with a dome, a sort of moon roof to see the Earth. That also has not been tested in space. Still, though, SpaceX firmly believes that this will be a safe mission. Of course, that's what we're all hoping for here. The launch is expected tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern. We'll be watching right here, and the world will definitely be watching this one. Diane and Terry? Well, that is fascinating, Gio. Thanks very much for that breakdown of what they're going to be doing up in space. Live coverage of this historic event begins tonight at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Join us on ABC News Live as we follow the crew's footsteps throughout this adventure. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.